Hey there, it's Bernadette, welcome back and thanks for being with me today. Today I'm really excited to talk about a breathing technique that is so useful for holding plank and just strength postures in general. So this was an absolute game changer for me um, when I learned it in yoga. So I wanna share it with you. So if you're wanting to know how you can hold a plank for way longer, um, then this is the perfect video for you. So we're gonna begin just standing and what we'll do is we'll practice this um, sort of way of breathing while we stand so that we can kind of get it into our bodies and then once we come into plank, it'll be a little bit more natural for you. So just bring your arms down by your sides and let's take a full breath in together. So let's take a big inhale and then a nice long exhale. And then let's do just one more like that. So big inhale together. And full exhale. Okay. Now as you inhale, this next breath in, you're going to stand up a little bit taller. So feel your heels pressing down. Feel the crown of your head, the top of your head reaching up towards the ceiling. So big, long inhale, get taller. As you exhale, low belly draws up and in. So just gently tighten your belly on exhale. And then inhale, stand a little bit taller. The belly relaxes just a bit, but it can stay a little bit firm. And then exhale, belly draws in. So this is exactly what we're gonna do in plank. So let's do two more breaths like that together. So inhale, stand tall, really like fine length every time. Exhale, tighten the belly. And then one more, inhale, stand tall. Exhale, tighten the belly and we're like hugging the belly in towards the spine. All right, so let's come on down and do our plank. So we'll get there with a little posture. So inhale here and stand up tall and let everything relax. And then as you exhale, just bend forward and lower down and drop your head. Shake your head out, yes and no. And then bring your hands to the floor, start to bend your knees and just come to your knees. And while we're here, we'll actually do that same little breath. So inhale and feel yourself getting long through the top of your head and then exhale, draw your belly in. Good. And then when you're ready, just come right on into your plank. So find your plank. So heels press back. We reach forward with the top of the head. The belly's hugged in towards the spine and we're going to breathe together. So what happens commonly when we hold a plank is once it starts to get a little bit exhausting, we either start to drop our hips and come into like a back bend, or we start to raise our hips up, right? So everything stays in line, and we're gonna breathe here, and we're gonna keep it nice and tight. So every time you inhale, reach forward with the top of your head, press back with your heels, just like when we were standing. Every time you exhale, tighten the belly. We'll do three more breaths like that. Hang onto your plank, inhale. Get long every time. It's like these little micro movements. Exhale, pull your belly in. Two more, inhale. Reach through the crown of the head, squeeze back with the heels. Exhale, belly draws in. One more breath here, you can do it. Inhale, get long, reach with the top of the head. Press back with the heels. Exhale, tighten the belly. Good. And then as you inhale, bring your knees down. And exhale, shift back to child's pose, and we'll just rest there for a moment. Good. And just to relax our backs, because I can't not compensate after holding a strength posture. So inhale, come on up. We'll do a couple rounds of chakra vakasana to stretch our backs. Exhale, belly draws in. Shift back. And then we'll do two more. Inhale and lift. Re draw the shoulders back. Exhale. Round into your back and press back towards your heels. And then one more. Inhale, lift it up. And exhale, shift back. Good. All right. So I would love to hear how you felt in that plank. And the trick is if we can breathe that way, it's almost like there's little micro movements on every single breath. And it's those little micro movements that actually can keep us more still and just more tightened up and energized the whole time. So every time you inhale, heels shoot back, top of the head shoots forward. Every time you exhale, belly draws in. I promise you, you're going to be able to 
hold your plank for so much longer if you can just use your breathing to your advantage. So I hope this has been super, super useful and helpful for you. Um, I hope this kicks up your yoga or whatever your fitness routine is up a notch. And if you want to learn how to practice yoga with me online, you can visit me at my website, BernadetteSolar.com. I'd love to have you for a yoga class. You can get your first class free um, just by finding the link on my website. Um, and I send out little yoga mini videos all the time. So definitely hop on my email list from my website. And I would love to see you again soon. So thanks again for joining me. And I'll see you soon.